Hello and welcome! I'm Audrey Gold. I am a NOCA student and a former JCC camp counselor and I'm so excited to be here today to interview some JCC gym members about their amazing JCC experiences. Let's get into it, guys. What makes it special about working out at the JCC? Um, I like working out at the JCC, A, because, well, <laughs> shocking, uh, I'm a neurotic Jew, and it's super yes. clean. Super <laughs> clean. It's easy to tell you that I, I love L-O-V-E, exclamation point, the fitness center. I am here almost, I think it's 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 a little bit weird, but I'm here every day. That it's a stable, nurturing, caring, Jewish place um, is important for me. I feel that Judaism when I'm here and that's very important in my life. But I also have friends here who are not Jewish and they love it and they feel the same thing. Do you have any stories that strike you about the JCC that yeah, signifies what a great community it truly is? In the olden or the old days, pre-pandemic. In uh, February. Going, <laughs> February, is that what it was? Can't remember anymore. But the, one of the highlights was going into the Schwitz. Now, do you know what Schwitz means? I, I do. <laughs> the steam room, place for a half dozen people, or so, and we were all very friendly. Schwitz friendships. French Schwitz. Yes. <laughs> um, I just love all the people. I love all the people who are part of the fitness center. I love all the people who work out there. I love seeing um, a ton of my friends and neighbors and you know, Jewish friends, not Jewish friends. Everybody's working out at the JCC. I mean, it is the place to be. There's now a cadre of friends I have that I have met that I did not know before who come and swim laps. And today I met Carl and we had like the best talks. And there's Elaine who I never would have met. She's not Jewish. She's from California. We met and we became good friends. And there's Leanne. I mean, that can just go on and on. That's amazing to hear. So we had those two months where there, the JCC was closed, where we couldn't go into the JCC. What was that like for you? sad. <laughs> I was sad. It just was a place I was very used to going to. It was it was a nightmare, a horrible thing, a terror. Um, so um, I've started running. <laughs> I, <hate> running. <laughs> I also hate running. We're in the I same boat. We all felt so isolated and, and deprived of the, of the normal things in life that we took for granted. I take the JCC for granted. And, and because it's such a beautiful part of my life. You, you do realize what a hub of um, social interaction and sort of nourishing your soul for human contact, um, you know, the JCC really does, does provide, so. What keeps bringing you back to the JCC? The people the, the, um, who work there, like Patrick and Ellis, are really wonderful and um, and always helpful, always friendly. Leslie's personality and the way she handles things permeates all the way down into the staff. There's such an interest in trying to make this a good place for its members. My granddaughter on a visit learned to swim because Kathleen, a, a legend Kathleen, um, taught her how to swim in the pool. And so- Kathleen had, taught me how to swim. <laughs> she's taught everybody how to swim, I think, probably. I think um, anybody in this city who has who can <laughs> swim is because Coach, Coach Kath taught us how. <laughs> yes. I really do enjoy seeing the staff and talking to them. I have gotten to be good friends with Kevin at the front desk of the fitness center when I walk in every morning to do my laps. And we've gotten to be such good friends that I bring them coffee every day. And then I got to know Andrew, who was over the whole fitness area, and he wanted coffee. So I started bringing <laughs> mugs of coffee to them. 
And then I saw Sam one day when I was handing out the coffee to Andrew and Tevin. And I thought, I don't even want to say hello because I know I'm going to end up bringing coffee for Sam too. And it's, I can't do this. <laughs> Has it always felt like this? Like the sense of community? A lot can be going on out there in the world that's frightening or produces anxiety, but you can come here and it's just even and the same place. And you can always count on that consistency. And I feel like that's just what is important. That's all the interviews we have today. Clearly the JCC is a special place where everybody is welcome. I've been Audrey Gold, bye. All right, I'm asking up, off we go. And thank you for such a lovely interview. <laughs> That's all. Thanks, Audrey.